Hi there, welcome to Cooking with Saucy Sean's Fine Eats, where we cook real food for real people. And we also sometimes show you some shortcuts. So Sarah and I were talking the other day, actually it's been a while now, but it was the other day, about bacon and how she doesn't like to cook it because it makes a mess. And I said, well, just cook it in your oven. And she's like, huh? I'm like, yeah. So here's a secret for you. Now, I gotta say, bacon is kind of controversial. Different people like their bacon differently. Personally, I like my bacon to be thick sliced I prefer it to be um, fully cured, like not, not wet. This this is actually a bit wet, but I like this bacon. It's actually a good bacon, President's Choice, old fashioned style. It's got good flavor to it. I prefer the drier bacon. And I don't like my bacon crispy. I actually like it to be cooked and well cooked. Maybe slightly getting crispy, but not, not that break apart crispy. It doesn't really matter how you like it. You can cook it the same way. In this case is I'm taking the cast iron frying pan I'm taking my kilogram of bacon. I'm going to cut it in half like that because I'm going to use this for English muffins. So I'm going to actually take this, cook, cook this all right now, and then over the next week I'll make breakfast with it. Um, I'll put it in the fridge or I can freeze it. And I can take out a couple, three, four slices, throw them into the microwave or into a pan, heat them up, cook up an egg, toast up an English muffin, slap them together and I've got a quick and easy breakfast because all the hard work was pre-done early. You can do it in single layers, you can do it, if you want it really crispy you're going to have to do it in single layers but because I'm not a crispy guy I just put in, pull it apart, put it into my pan, put it in my oven at 400 to 450 for 20 to 30 minutes until it's cooked to where I like it, take it out, drain it and I have bacon. It's just that easy. Okay, there's the bacon ready to go in the oven. This is going to be in the oven for 20 to 30 minutes at 400 or 450, depending on what you like. The one thing to say about bacon is it just shows how, you know, when you're making a breakfast, the, the, the hen was involved in making the breakfast, but the pig was truly committed to breakfast. Okay, so we have our bacon. It's come out of the oven. It's in about half an hour. I like it cooked about to this level. You might not. You might like it cooked more. That's fine. I don't judge you. Please don't judge me. It's all about personal taste. So it's done. I'm going to simply take it out of the pan, put it onto a foil, uh, not a foil, that's a paper towel uh, covered plate. Let it drain. Clean up the pan. Basically, once this bacon cools a bit, I can put it in the fridge, I can put it in the freezer, and I can just use the amount I want when I need it, and I'll cook it up a little bit more when I do that. It's just that simple to cook bacon with no mess in your kitchen. There's no, that's hobo speaking, by the way, so just sorry about the extra kitty noise. He's complaining about something. But there's no mess. Uh, you got a frying pan to clean up. There's no bacon grease splatter. There's no burns. It's just that easy. So thank you for watching this video. Please thumbs up the video, subscribe to our channel, like us. We really appreciate it. If you have questions or comments, please leave them in the uh, area below. Thank you very much.